drives you to mm -hmm. excel in your area of expertise? I mean, you've accomplished mm -hmm. quite a bit. You've been mm -hmm. in one position for a good length of time, a yeah. couple of decades. It's hard to do in almost any profession in this day and age. True. What drives you to excel? You know, when I was a teenager, mm -hmm. uh, I spent quite a bit of time at a church down the street from my own church. Mm -hmm. And uh, it was a very large church. Uh, on the side of that building, mm -hmm. in the stone, were the words, excellence in all things, okay. and all things to God's glory. That's great. And I have never outgrown that. Uh, mm -hmm. that that's actually a passion uh, that uh, I adopted as my own personal maxim. So okay. it's excellence in all things, but all things for God's glory. So mm -hmm. it's not just excellence in terms of a human frame of reference. It's sure. because ultimately, uh, I hope and and uh, pray that everything I do is to the glory of God, and that requires excellence. Sure. Uh, and so that means certainly meeting earthly, uh, contemporary standards of excellence, but it mm -hmm. also meets, uh, requires uh, meeting a higher standard even than that. Mm -hmm. How do you feel you're doing, your personal opinion? Well, uh, th yeah. that's where, <laughs> yes. in terms of biblical Christianity, we come to understand uh, we, we always fall short, but right. we know that uh, uh, that's the calling to which we are called. Mm -hmm. And uh, I can look back with a lot of thankfulness. I, I won't say Great. satisfaction. Sure. Uh, I, I might allow myself that at certain points, but it's really more than anything else, mm -hmm. gratitude and thankfulness. Now, in your family background, fathers, mm -hmm. grandfathers, yeah. on your mother's side, were they, were they in the religious leadership or what were their backgrounds? Not in terms of the ministry. Okay. Uh, as a matter of fact, you go back far enough, my family is actually uh, Anabaptist or Amish. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. And, okay. Uh, but uh, more recently, uh, they were all involved in church, uh, fathers, mothers, grandfathers, grandmothers, mm -hmm. but, uh, but not ministers. And so I, I'm really the first generation in that sense in my family. Mm -hmm.